Mayor Lightfoot repeated again this afternoon this explosive development would not have happened if not for the two plus years of dogged work by the CBS2 investigators to get to the bottom of a pattern of bad raids. By pattern, we mean dozens, more than 50 wrong raids that we've been able to document. And Jeanette Young's case, just one. In each case, we brought our findings to both police and the mayor's office with no action until now. Continue our team coverage. Chicago's aldermen now say they have demands. CBS 2's Jim Williams live with that. Jim, they too held a news conference today on the Young case. Brad, the city council's black aldermen say they want reforms after watching CBS 2's coverage of the case. But as you noted, the CBS 2 investigators have spent the last two years uncovering wrong police raids. So where have the aldermen been before now? They said they were angry. Words cannot express the outrage that we as black residents of the city of Chicago feel. They apologized to Ann Jeanette Young. We allowed for a, a African-American woman to be humiliated in the public for no reason at all. Now, days after CBS2 broke the story that has outraged the nation, the city council's black caucus vows action to stop the Chicago Police Department's wrong raids. But for two years, the CBS2 investigators have uncovered a series of botched raids, 50 stories over two years. Dozens of homes, cops with wrong addresses, guns drawn, breaking down doors, terrorizing innocent Chicagoans, including children. This is the saddest moment. So we wondered, where was the city council's anger and oversight before CBS2 uncovered the raid at Anjanette Young's home? Why this action now? Why not a year ago, a year and a half ago? It was unfortunate that it got to this point, but uh, we are here now and we will uh, do the legislative fixes that need to be done and hold the appropriate parties accountable uh, for their actions and or inactions uh, during this time. Among the Black Caucus's demands, more civilian oversight of the police department and abolishing search warrants based solely on the word of informants. And to watch the CBS documentary Unwarranted and to see case after case of these errors and their impact is heart-wrenching. The Black Caucus also wants a new city council committee to examine the settlements in police misconduct cases last year, the city of Chicago, or we should say taxpayers, have had to dish out $58 million in those cases. We're live, Jim Williams, CBS 2 News. A lot of green just begun. Thank you, Jim. To catch up on our extensive reporting on wrong raids by Chicago police, including unwarranted, check out the CBS 2 investigator section of our CBS Chicago app.